This is the cooling unit I bought for the uh, CNC router. Uh, consists of a uh, heat exchanger, which acts like a little radiator, and a small pump that contains a reservoir for the water. I bought this from uh, Ugra CNC online. Then I had to purchase a bunch of other parts, uh, the tubing uh, and some fittings, which I got from McMaster Car. There are two different size tubings, uh, 5 16 ID for the uh, pump and heat exchanger. Then I had to convert it to quarter inch ID to go to the spindle motor. Right here, I don't know if you can see it very good, but I've got two uh, for the two hoses. I've got a quarter inch coupling and a barbed fitting on each of the hoses connected together to change from one size to the other. And then dismounted a little uh, aluminum bracket there to hold it in place. I had to make some aluminum brackets for mounting this stuff too. Two aluminum plates right here just to mount the radiator on there. Not real stable because it's only got two screw holes in the back to mount it to my uh, little eighth inch flat bar there, but it seems to hold it okay. And the good thing is it rides with the uh, router as it's moving along, and the pump is just a piece of eighth inch uh, flat aluminum bolted into the uh, extrusion here. I had to get another piece of cable track for the tubing to go to the motor. Made another little bracket right here that consists of just a piece of, uh, I believe that's 16 thick uh, aluminum flat bar uh, screwed to the aluminum plate here and two holes with two grom uh, rubber grommets just to protect the tubing so it can move back and forth as the z-axis goes up and down. There's another look at the uh, brass coupling. Change from one size tube to the other. The cooling fan and the pump run on 12 volt DC. So I've got a uh, 12 volt power supply plugged in underneath. And of course the wire to power that rides in the cable track with the other cables and goes down to the panel box. I just mounted a separate little miniature toggle switch there to turn the pump on and off. The pump and fan is very quiet. I've got the circuit turned on now. I don't know if you can see the fan turning or not. But there's a little blue uh, light in the pump that know, lets you know that the pump is on. Because you can't hardly see it circulating through the tubing. But it's very quiet. And it seems to be working pretty good. Uh, before, if you ran the router for more than five minutes, it started getting pretty hot. And now it just barely gets warm for after, say, 15, 20 minutes. So I think it's going to do the trick. And be good enough for what I want to do. They make a bigger heat exchanger that has a dual fan on it, but I opted to get the single one to start out with to see how it was going to do. And it seems like the little pump with the small reservoir is going to be sufficient. I think it's 79 gallons per hour or something like that. So that's, uh, that's the cooling system. Uh, thanks for watching.